Hey angels. So guys, I'm just going to give you the truth and I'm going to be real with you about the time when I had a stalker, okay? So first of all, this happened some years ago, okay? Some years ago. Years ago. So what happened was um, I met this crazy guy at the mall, okay? So the first day and the first time that I met him, um, he seemed like he was okay the first day I met him and we was talking, you know, in the mall and everything. But um, ended up this guy asked me for my phone number and said he wanted to take me out. So I gave the guy my phone number. Because he seemed like he was an okay guy at the time. But to be honest with you, I gave him my phone number actually before we kind of got deep in our conversation. So by the time um, it was time for me to leave out the mall, I already knew that I really did not want to go out with this guy. Because, you know, from the things that... He said to me in our conversations, but I never said, don't call me. I just said, well, you know, to keep from hurting his feelings, when we get, um, when I get home and he calls me, I just won't answer. Or maybe he won't call. That's what I was thinking. Well, boy, was I wrong. Okay, boy, was I wrong. When I got home, you know, everything was fine. But the next day, this man calls me. I answered, I answered the phone. And then when I find out who it was, I knew the phone number. So I said, okay, well, I won't be answering the phone anymore. So the next day comes. And soon, like, I went out um, and did a couple of things, you know, went shopping, did some stuff. And when I got back, as soon as I stepped foot back in the house, this man calls me. The phone started ringing. I looked at the caller ID, and I was like, what the hell is going on? How does he know to call me as soon as I walk in the house? This is creepy. I already am not feeling him. Don't want him to call me back. So I didn't answer the phone. So an hour later, the phone is ringing again. Look at the call ID. It's him again. Don't you understand? Don't you understand? Like, what don't you understand? I don't want to talk to you. Why are you calling me again? Do I really have to say it? Are you smart enough not to read be read between the lines here? I'm not answering. So, another hour goes by and it's him again. He calls me that day every hour on the hour. But I did not answer. Okay, I did not answer. Why the hell do you keep calling? Don't you understand? I do not want to talk to you. I want nothing to do with you. Leave me alone. Read between the lines. Don't make me have to get on the phone and tell you. And make this plain and simple. Stop calling me. Stop it. This is getting crazy. You're stalking me. So, after all that, the next day, the same thing goes on all over again. Okay, all over again. You know, this was crazy. Like, every time I walk in the house, like a little bit, after I walk in the house or come in someplace, the phone was ringing. And it was him. This went on for about a month, guys. A month. 
And yes, I avoided the calls for a month. What don't you understand? Do I have to pick up the phone and actually say to you, stop calling me? Do not call me ever again. Well, okay, yes, I avoided the calls for a month. And finally, I got my peace back, okay? It stopped after a month. But then again, maybe like two weeks went on. Everything was fine. After two weeks, it started up again. The second time, it lasted for at least maybe a month and a half. I was, you know, I was afraid. I was wondering, what is going on? What the hell do you want from me? What the hell do you want from me? Don't you understand what's going on? Can't you read between the lines? I do not want to talk to you. Well, obviously, he didn't. Because it kept going on for another month and a half. And it took me, like, all this time. I avoided the phone calls. I never answered. But I was being harassed and stalked. Because every time I walk in my house, my phone started ringing. And, like, every hour, it would ring. And it was this same person well finally after this second time he caught on obviously or he just got tired I don't I don't know what happened but it stopped and I was so thankful okay I was so thankful because it was making me sick it was making me mad angry just leave me the hell alone. That's all I ask. Give me some peace. That's all I wanted. Well, anyways, thank you guys. And <laughs> seriously, thank you so much <laughs> for listening to um, this crazy um, story time. Definitely. I just had to tell you guys exactly how I felt. It's, um, it may be funny now, but I can promise you when it was going on, it was anything but funny. It was scary as hell. Seriously. So thank you so much, guys. And don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, and just let me know how you guys feel about this situation. And have any one of you guys ever been in something, in a, you know, in a situation like this or anything similar. Thank you guys. Bye.